Hello there everyone, thank you for joining us. It's still Saturday, October 27th, 2012. Um, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go over some weather alerts that have been put in effect for Connecticut uh, in advance of Hurricane Sandy. Okay, a coastal flood warning for the entire Connecticut shoreline is going to go into effect 6 o'clock a.m. Monday morning. It's going to last until 3 o'clock p.m. on Tuesday. A high wind watch for all of Connecticut is going to go into effect late Monday and Monday night and a flood watch for all of interior Connecticut is going to go in effect for Monday and Tuesday. Okay, so again, close, coastal flood warning for the entire Connecticut shoreline going into effect 6 a.m. on Monday to 3 o'clock p.m. on Tuesday. High wind watch for all of Connecticut late Monday and Monday night uh, will go into effect late Monday, Monday night. Flood watch for all of interior Connecticut will be going into effect for Monday and Tuesday. So we do have some weather alerts that are in effect now for flooding and for high wind right now. No, uh, no tropical storm watches or hurricane watches or anything like that have been issued as of yet. We will, uh, of course, keep you posted through the day tomorrow on that. Now let's go over the forecast for this uh, once again. Hurricane Sandy still expected to affect Connecticut late Monday and Tuesday. Exceptionally high astronomical high tide in addition to the effects of Hurricane Sandy's approach could make high tide two to three feet higher than normal Sunday evening and up to five to eight feet above normal by Monday evening's high tide, especially with the um, full moon on Monday evening. So, um, tomorrow, Sunday, um, October 28th, we have mostly cloudy with showers, developing breezy, high 60 inland, 62 the shore. Monday, cloudy with heavy rain and with damaging winds of 30 to 45 miles an hour, Gusts plus with 60 plus miles an hour developing by afternoon, lasting through overnight. High 61 and 64 the shore. Tuesday, cloudy with more rain, wind and rain. Wind gusts could exceed 60 miles an hour in the morning, with wind diminishing in the afternoon. High 62 degrees and 65 at the shore. Uh, Wednesday, October 31st, Halloween, mostly cloudy with a chance for showers, still breezy. High 61 degrees and 64 the shore. And next Thursday, November 1st, partly mostly cloudy with a chance for a shower, breezy high, 58 degrees and 60 at the shore. So as far as Hurricane Sandy goes, the temperatures are not going to be that cold, which is nice because that kind of makes it a lot harder for any type of snow to work its way into the mix for us in Connecticut anyway. And it also makes it better so if we do have widespread power outages, which we likely will, um, it won't be as big of a deal because it won't be crazy cold. So it won't be a huge deal to be without heat for a few days. It's not going to be crazy cold kind of going to be in the mid 60s for the most part throughout this weather event. Um, that's it. That's your Hurricane Sandy update for now. We're going to be doing several more video updates throughout the day tomorrow on Sunday and we'll see you then. Thanks for joining us.